hello guys welcome or welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new here you're welcome if you're not new thank you so much for coming back so guys today we are going to be making stir fry meat and i'd like to show you guys how i make my stir fry so for the ingredients you're going to need uh, meat of course any of your choice it can be beef it can be mutton it can be lamb any of your choice so you need meat over here you need to cut them into small pieces then over here i have onions red onions you can use even the white onions it doesn't really matter over here i have my garlic and ginger paste then over here i have tomatoes i used one I have a bell pepper the yellow one and we have the red bell pepper i used half of each over here we have salt we have oil there we have turmeric powder we have black pepper we have cumin and uh, we have curry powder we also have paprika so that's it for our ingredients today guys let's go straight to the video So guys, at this point, I'm going to add in my black pepper so that it can be cooked together. About a half a teaspoon of black pepper will be enough. Just mix everything together. I don't want to add salt now because uh, the meat is not yet done and salt and when you put salt when your meat when it's not yet done it becomes hard so we're going to wait for this to be done a little bit then we can go in with our salt so guys after a few minutes you're going to notice that your oil the one you had put earlier has started to dry up and your meat is going to be a little bit tender. It also depends with the meat that you have. Some take time to become tender. But over here, our meat is looking good. Now, the next thing I'm going to do, I'm going to add in my garlic and ginger paste, about a teaspoon. I crushed them together. And I'm going to mix this well with my meat so that it can cook together. This adds in really nice taste and also gives a good aroma to the food so yeah make sure you mix them well and let it get to every part of your meat
and now guys this is when you can go in with your salt also the amount of salt you're going to use is going to depend on the amount of uh, meat you have you know so just measure the amount of salt with the quantity of the meat that you have available The next step guys, I'm going to add in my onions. So guys, you're going to let your onions cook together with your meat until the onions are uh, changing their color and they are looking a bit translucent. That's it, guys. And over here, guys, I just went in with about a half a teaspoon of curry powder. Next thing guys, I'm going in with about a teaspoon of paprika. Also guys, you can go ahead and add in any spice that you like. You can add in cumin, you can add in, uh, you know, any spice of your choice. Today I didn't want to use a lot of spices, so that's about it for the spices that we used. Next guys, I'm going in with my tomatoes. Then next guys, I'm going in with my bell peppers. So guys, this is uh, our end result. You can have this with chapati, mahamri, anything that you like. You can also have it with uh, rice. That's just your preference, guys. Thank you so much for watching. So guys, we've come to the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you're going to try it. Please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. And don't forget to leave a like, comment, and uh, 
share this video bye